there is one more possibility in the X path, which is nothing but contains key. Contains key is the one of the most widely used or majorly used in the X paths to identify most of the locators because there might be a chance of like contains we I wanted to use this contains to identify text I wanted to use identify attributes so I can do on both the options try to uh, use this option so I will go back to the application and now uh, let me go and try to inspect this form field I will remove this here so this is an input type and here you can use the directly input tag or use a wildcard option. I can use a star option, the wildcard option. So star refers to everything. You can see here you have 2005, I mean 258 kind of lines or matchings. It means that it's a wildcard option. So it will identify entire thing what is available on the page. And you can use the contains here. So contains will be all lowercase and it's an English word contains and then followed by this bracket symbols and then at the rate either you can use id or name or uh, any other attribute that is there within the identified web element this is the web element so there is there are i name id uh, tab index placeholder then you have autocomplete out of focus so you have many things here i will take the placeholder first right instead of id i will take a placeholder placeholder and then you have to put a comma separated then again the string values so what are the string values within that so there is a string value of placeholder called this email address or phone number so it is the same thing that is displaying on this form field right so you can use the form field so it is identifying as one of one so this is the one approach of using contains. So I will show you one more uh, option using a, a different name here. So using a name. So the name will be most of the times we will see. So name and I will remove this entire value. So value is not same. So that is the reason it is not identifying. So I will say name as email right it is identified as one of one so here uh, there is no text for this input so when you can use the text is when you have this uh, the tag so input tag if the input tag has some text under that then you can use that text so best way is the login button I think login button uh, has a text to show in it so you can see here login so it is showing us a text here so you can use this option and you can also use this uh, sign up for facebook so here also it is using a text option so how you can use that so i will copy this text from here and here i will remove this name attribute and then all now using contains wildcard option star contains then you have a text here text method and separated by comma and then you have the text so this is a text so now it is identifying one of one so this is the one way of using a text approach